Today's topic is on instructions. What do I mean when I say instructions? When you need to tell someone how to do something, then you give a set of instructions. So, what are the basic features of instructions? One, first of all, when you need to write instructions, you have to give a specific title. You need to be very precise, meaning you have to make use of that word instructions in your title. Next, avoid jargon and technical terms. Later, it is important for you to use imperative verbs, meaning every statement should begin with a root verb. Four, all your statements have to be specific and arrange them in logical order. Finally, don't forget to use short sentences. When you use lengthy sentences, people will not understand what you're trying to tell. So it has to be written in short sentences. Well, what do you see on my screen? It is lemon juice. Now I'm going to tell you how to make lemon juice. So first of all, let's give the title. Instructions to make lemon juice. Next, as per the rule, we need to number the points. So, first point, you take a lemon and cut it into equal halves. Two, squeeze the lemon juice into the glass. Three, add sugar, salt and water. After that, stir it properly until the content dissolves in water. Five, serve the lemon juice with ice cubes. So, this is the procedure for making lemon juice. All of us know. Now, let's see whether we followed the rule. Title we've given, we have numbered the points and then we've started each sentence with a root word. Take, squeeze, add, stir, serve. So every single sentence here is in the statement, every single statement we have a root word. So we have to start the statement with a root word and that is done here. Well, let's see how to withdraw money from an ATM. So, first of all, I'm going to give the title. The title is Instructions to Withdraw Money from ATM. So, the first step is I should insert the ATM card. Next, I should select the language. After that, I have to enter the four-digit ATM PIN. Then, select the transaction. After that, you need to select the account whether it is a current account or a savings account and then later you enter the amount to be withdrawn once you enter the amount to be withdrawn you need to collect the cash and then take the printed receipt it doesn't stop there you have to press the cancel button before leaving the ATM mission room so this is the step-by-step -step process of, of how to withdraw money from ATM well let's see whether we have satisfied the rules for writing instructions. I said we have to give a precise and a specific title. Yes, of course, we have given. Next, I said you need to number the points. We have done. And once you start writing the points, you have to begin with a root verb. This is what I meant. So, what are the points to remember while writing instructions? A specific and a precise title which means the title should carry the word instructions then don't forget to number your points one two three do not use bullets three begin each statement with a root verb four for your convenience in case they say write a set of eight instructions divide your instructions into Four plus four, that is four do's and four don'ts, meaning what you should do, four points, what you should not do, remaining four points. So this is how you're going to write instructions. Hope you understood. Thank you.